as I mentioned, one of the significant uh, ecological targets of this preservation effort would be the pre preservation of a vernal pool, which I'm standing in front of. Vernal pools are very distinctive and kind of discrete uh, ecological communities that exist. They are typically uh, devoid of water for much of the year. They do get water in the spring, hence the name vernal, being spring vernal pools. They fill up with water um, at the highest level in the spring due to spring rains as well as you know, snow melt in the, in the winter time. And it's that time of year that you get a variety of amphibians that come down to these vernal pools and use them for breeding. Things like wood frogs, tiger salamanders, spotted salamanders, warbled salamanders, even blue spotted salamanders. These are species of amphibians that depend upon vernal pools for them to be able to successfully reproduce. And in the absence of these beautiful vernal pools, these, these temporary pools, they would disappear.